In this video, I will show you how to send WhatsApp messages using Google Sheets. Note that this technique will be useful when you want to send the same but customized WhatsApp messages to multiple persons. Take a look at the data in this Google Sheet. Here I have a list of few friends, their phone numbers and the amount each of them needs to pay to our health club. Now let's see how to send a personalized WhatsApp message to each of these guys which will have their name and the details of the pending amount. For that, the first step is creating messages. In the formula bar, equal, double quotes, hi, space, double quotes, ampersand, select the cell containing name, ampersand, double quotes, comma, space, double quotes, ampersand, select the cell containing amount, ampersand, double quotes, is due, please pay as soon as possible. Double quotes, enter. Copy this formula into the cells below. See all these messages have the corresponding name as well as the pending amount. Next we will generate a link that will send this message through WhatsApp. In the formula bar, equal, hyperlink, open parentheses, double quotes, https, colon, forward slash, forward slash, web.whatsapp.com, forward slash, send, question mark, phone equal, double quotes, ampersand, select the cell containing phone number, ampersand, double quotes, ampersand, text equal, double quotes, ampersand, select the cell containing message, comma, now the text to display in these cells, double quotes, send message, double quotes, close parentheses, enter. See a hyperlink has been created in this cell. This blue color represents a hyperlink. Let's copy this formula into the cells below. Now to send this message through WhatsApp, click on the corresponding link. A new tab opened in the browser loading WhatsApp web. Using WhatsApp on the phone, scan the QR code shown on the screen. Note that this is a one-time process. Once your phone is linked to the computer, you won't need to scan the QR code again unless you log out or switch devices. See message came to WhatsApp from Google Sheets. Click on the send button and the message got delivered. Back to Google Sheets. Again. The best part is you can use this method to send WhatsApp messages to numbers that are not saved in your contact list. I have also done a video on sending WhatsApp messages using Excel. The link for the same is shared in the video description. Thank you for watching and wish you a great day.